the preprint of my article, Dark Matter Puzzle Solution, is now published <coughs> on the MDPE preprints. Uh, and uh, if we want to, in my view, if we want to uh, progress physics and cosmology, we have to step out of the uh, of the known paradigm. And the known paradigm is that universe exists in a fundamental arena of the of of uh, which is space time <clears throat> so <clears throat> mainstream of physics still today is teaching us that uh, space time is the the the, the 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 main frame in which everything happened this is not right space time is only a model there is no time in the universe as a fourth dimension. Universal space is, is energy, is primordial energy that was never created and will never be destroyed. <clears throat> okay. This is dark energy. And we have, finally, we have to somehow get in our mind that dark energy is a syntropic type of energy. The main law of universe is syntropy. Entropy is valid only for matter. Entropy enters at the scale of atom and above. What is below has no entropy. <clears throat> Electron, proton, photon, these are syntropic particles. They have no entropy because dark energy is a syntropic type of energy. And everything what exists, all elementary particles that exist, that exists are different forms of dark energy. Everything what we see is a, is a dark energy that has taken a form. <clears throat> all these ideas about supersymmetry in the in the first moments of Big Bang, and uh, and that there was enough, uh, uh, the same amount of antimatter in that moment. All this is a crap. Antimatter is man-made. Yeah, antimatter is produced in the laboratory, but. There is no antimatter in the universe. <clears throat> in the universe, we have only dark energy and the form of the dark energy. Electromagnetic radiation, this already is a form of dark energy. Photon is a wave of dark energy. Uh, <clears throat> and universe, <clears throat> universe definitely is eternal. There was no creation. Uh, this Big Bang theory is, uh, is is childish theory. This is for children. This is not this is not for adult <laughs> human beings. Uh, so. The preprint is published. Uh, my idea is that uh, universal space, dark energy is rotating 
around the black holes. And that's why we have velocities of star as already was observed by Zwicky. <clears throat> this was al already now 70 years ago or 80 years ago. And that searching for WIMPs particles is a waste of time and energy. Uh, what is beautiful in this model that I propose that we don't need to do any modification of, of, of gravitational theories. Sure, I know that this, um, this my uh, uh, <clears throat> proposal probably will not be well accepted because immense amount of money and time was invested into searching for the moon, new, to, let's say, Many articles are published uh, on Mond uh, in very respectful scientific journals. And many, many articles are published about <clears throat> WIMPs particles in also very respect respected scientific journals. And now the guy appeared from Slovenia, from nowhere, and he say, now, listen, we have another solution, I, I'm sure that, uh, that uh, this my idea is for future generations. They will go on, they will go on with WIMPs, they will go all on with MOND, because uh, <clears throat> this is the, this is how the spirit of physics today is. Doing something, calculating something, spending years and years, to earn some money, <laughs> to earn some money. 80% of articles in theoretical physics are absolute bullshit. <laughs> Taking few equations here, few equations here, mixing them and mix and makes a new theories. In this way, we will not progress physics. <laughs> there will be no progress in this way. We have to step out, out of the known. Thank you very much.